Fora TV. The world is thinking. So then, then people who you know claim to have been abducted and uh, are worrying about aliens coming to visit us, you're you're very skeptical of that. And I'd, I'd like to read a little passage, just a, a, a sentence. It says, uh, if you still believe that aliens would travel hundreds of light years to carve temporary graffiti in our wheat, then your imagination is one of the seven wonders of the world and should be bronzed. <laughs> <laughs> so so, so you, I, I think you're not just a skeptic. You're, you're outright saying no chance, no, no chance of aliens coming well, to visit us. Well, I, I, yeah, that, that's pretty extreme, Blaze. Really? No? But, but you're right. I am skeptical, particularly okay. in this case, yeah. crop circles. Okay. Right? Crop circles, they usually appear overnight or at the ends of weekends, mm -hmm. right? You, you think the aliens have strange union rules. We can, only, <laughs> we can only carve graffiti in their weed on the weekends. I mean, come on. That, and, that, 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 and around that, holidays when the yeah. colleges go yeah. on break. And, and, and by the way, in two counties in, in Britain, too, uh -huh. by the way, we're not, we're not going to talk. They're English-speaking aliens, aren't they? Yeah, well, yeah. apparently. Well, they, they make these nice patterns. You know, they would be good as maybe tile designers for your bathroom or something. Mm -hmm. like mm -hmm. But they're not conveying any but, information. But, but I mean, my, my question really is sort of, okay, how do you, what is um, how do you reconcile this notion that there is intelligent life out there, but that it, it's and, and perhaps for, with intelligence that far exceeds our, our own capabilities, but that it, these aliens are not visiting us? Well, several things. It isn't impossible that they could be visiting, you know, right? A third of the public believes that aliens are visiting Earth. I mean, that, that's not, you know, a, a small minority of the population. You know, one out of every three, some, some polls, one out of every two. You know, half the people in any room will think, yeah, yeah, the, the aliens are visiting and the government knows. <laughs> and it's covering up, by the way. And people love to think our government covers stuff up. And for its part, the government occasionally does cover stuff up right. to, you know, keep the, keep the game interesting. But my, my objection there is, is twofold. One... Uh, why are they here now? That, that to me is an important point because the Earth's been around for four and a half billion years, right? And they just happen to arrive now. We, we start seeing things in the sky, you know, in the very decades when we finally have the technology to put a lot of our own things in the sky. Mm -hmm. That's a little bit suspect, I think. Yeah. Why now? They don't know about us. I think it's safe to say no aliens know about us because our TV signals, our radar, and all that hasn't gotten very far out into space. There's probably nobody's watching I Love Lucy yet. Not yet. So they don't know we're uh -huh. here. So if they're here now, wow, that's an amazing coincidence. So that's point one, you know, just on sort of uh, theoretical grounds, if you will. It doesn't seem to make a lot of sense. But the real objection is something else. And that is thousands of reports are made every year of things in the sky that people think are alien craft. It would only take one good report that you could stack up in the museums or, or farm out to academia, and everybody would believe this is true. And yet, all these thousands of reports, there's not one good one. And to me, that's, that's mm -hmm. significant.